Okay, this is the first video in a series um, that will complete the or that will go to teach the notes for completing a square, the Algebra 2 lesson that we're starting the semester with. Um, in order to complete the square, we have a number of minor skills we need to establish before we can go into the actual process of completing the square. Um, two of these three uh, skills are ones that you should already have in place from first semester. The first of those is simplifying a square root without a calculator. So this video will cover that part of the lesson. Now again, it's worth noting that the calculators we have in class, the ones that we suggested that you get for class, the TI-30 uh, XS multiviews, can reduce roots for you. However, the calculator is a tool. It is not a brain. There are things it cannot do that you have to do to earn full credit on these problems. For instance, root 18. Root 18 is not a perfect square. Your calculator will reduce it. And the way it will reduce it is it will break it into two separate square roots, one of which is the largest perfect square that divides 18 evenly. That would be 9. And the other is the other factor that pairs with 9 to equal 18. So because 9 is a perfect square and 9 times 2 is 18, your calculator will break that into a root 9 and a root 2. It will then tell you the positive square root, which is 3 root 2. Now this answer is not complete. You need to tell me not just the positive root, but also the negative root. If you forget the plus or minus, you will have only given me half the answers, and you will only get half the points, period. So let's do another one, root 200. The square root of 200, well, that's not a perfect square, but it is divisible by 100, which is a perfect square. So we should break that into a root 100 and a root 2, which means we are looking at plus or minus 10 root 2. Now those are the two that you really need to have mastered for completing the square because there are not going to be any variables in the roots that you're being asked to, re to reduce for completing the square. But we're reviewing it, so we might as well review it the right way. 50x squared, the square root of 50x squared. So we'll start off, we'll break that into 25 times 2. Now, as for variables, whenever we have a variable, we ask ourselves a very simple question. Is the exponent squared, even or odd? It is even, so what we do is we say, okay, it's an even exponent, that means it has a square root. So it will go underneath the root with the number that has a square root. So then we will take that square root, square root of 25 is plus or minus 5, and then for the exponents, what we do is we take that power and we divide the exponent by 2. So that would be 5 to the first power, I'm sorry, 5x to the first power, and then we still have a square root 2 attached to the end of it. Root 72x to the fourth, again, 72 is not a perfect square, but it is divisible by 36. In this case, we're looking at 36 times 2. And I didn't really realize when I made these notes originally how many of these were something times 2. I wish I had because I would have changed them up x to the fourth is even, so it goes with 36, and we're looking at plus or minus 6x to the second, because we divide that exponent by 2, 4 divided by 2 is 2, and then we still have a root 2 on the end. Now e is a little bit different. Uh, first off, it does still break into 25 times a number, in this case 6, but 7 is the first example we've had where the variable has been an odd power. So what we do in this situation is we make this even by breaking one of those seven x's off and leaving it with the will not reduce pile. So one of those seven x's goes with the six, and the other six, they go with the 25. So we would be looking at plus or minus 5x to the third, because again we divide this exponent by two, root 6x, because that root 6x cannot be reduced. One more like that, root 98 breaks into a 49 and a 2. 19 is odd, so one of those 19 will go with the 2. The other 18 of those 19 will go with the 49. That is plus or minus 7x to the 9th, root 2x. 
That handles our review for this minor skill.